Who's your gardener here? Hello YouTube. Just out here in the garden today. Uh, getting ready to do some fertilizing on my um, raised bed here. So uh, this is the, the tall bed. If y'all remember. It's about you know, 10, 20, 30. About 36 inches high. These are 2 by 10s still haven't got them painted that's on the list uh, got some lettuce growing here in the corners I planted a little bit of cilantro Let's see here's another one coming up uh, different mix of lettuce um, back here I have um, pak choy and um, I love this stuff. It's good to eat. Looks like I had some bugs eating on it. I better get some. I saw a, um, of all things, this early in the season, grasshoppers. But, yep, there's one right there. Get out of there. Anyways, I thought I'd bring you out here show you what I was up to. So, I've got right here a row of carrots starting to mark the row. And right here starting to mark a row. In between them you see this dark stuff uh, that would be my fertilize so um, I'm gonna show you I've got another row of carrots marked right here now what my fertilizer is is simply coffee grounds okay now some people think that the uh, coffee grounds are too acidic for the garden um, I guess from what I understand all of the acid um, is actually taken up in the um, brewing process actually so when you have your spent grounds they make excellent fertilizer not only that the worms love them so I'm just out here side dressing um, these early carrots here I get my camera over here what I'm doing I'm sorry um, I just keep them in this old ice cream bucket. My my wife, when she makes coffee, um, I do drink some coffee, y'all. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. I may have a problem. I don't know. Um, usually from the time that I get up until the time that I go to bed, um, I'm drinking coffee. I just like it. Always have. I guess I really didn't have any choice in the matter. Uh, the reason I say that is is my mother when she was whoo sorry about the camera work when she was pregnant with me as a baby or before i was a baby i guess uh you know women have crazy cravings when they're when they're pregnant um she craved coffee grounds not coffee but coffee grounds and she also craved uh, lemons and salt so <laughs> what she would do is she'd sit down and uh, she would make herself up a plate and in that plate she would um, she would quarter lemons and um, what she would do is she would uh, take the lemon dip it in the salt and then she would dip it in the coffee grounds and then suck the salt and the coffee grounds off of the lemon so strange i know but um and then she'd wonder why i wouldn't stop kicking for nine months so i actually had coffee intravenous i guess you could say i don't know if that's the right word but and before i was even born so um I drink a lot of it now if you don't drink coffee uh, you can actually go to a coffee shop you know your local coffee shop and you can ask them um, for their spent coffee grounds and you know if you've got a, a larger area you want to cover uh, you could do that and uh, it works great so just a little something I'm doing out here 
uh, in the old Hoosier State, Indiana. Um, got some beets. They're doing real good. I, I side dressed them about a week ago with this coffee, uh, and and they were they were great. Also that um, little row of pak choy, I did the same thing with. Um, I haven't done the the uh, onions. I've been kind of waiting for them to bulb a little bit. Still early for them. Um, shoots are doing okay and such, but I'm kind of waiting for them to to start to bulb before I start adding anything to them. But well, short little video. I just thought I'd share with you what I'm doing. Who's your gardener here? Lord bless. Have a good day.